understand that everyone would like to have a property of their own but the thing is who are eligible to invest uh, for a house and life and as long as you are a Filipino citizen pwede kang bumili ng pwede kang bumili ng property let me emphasize that for a foreigner you are not allowed to to get to buy a house in that as uh, unless you are married to a Filipina so you must be Condominium, anyone can buy. Foreigner can buy condominium units. So you must, at least at a uh, legal age of 18 years old, you must pass the required income for the investment plan and you must have the necessary documentary requirements. Bakit kailangan natin ng mga documentary requirements? So unless you are purchasing the property uh, through cash or, or you're paying that in full, we don't need... Of, we don't need so much requirements from you but since most of the in most of the most of the buyers will go will get their loan through bank or through public financing therefore you must abide and you must follow the the list of requirements na kailangan mo ipasa for you to uh, build the housing loan so what are those syempre valid ids kailangan you have to get your government id you must have the proof of billing kung saan po kayo nakatira kasi doon po bini-verify kung doon po pupuntahan ng doon po isi-CI kayo ng ng mga financial institution you must have you must have the pay slip or certificate of employment or job contract kasi doon po nakalagay kung magkano talaga yung kinikita ninyo kada buwan you must uh, pass a senomar if you declared you are single so dito hindi po pwedeng lumusot yung mga hiwalay at in uh, ilagay niyo po na single as long pag sinabing single you must pass senomar so if you are married you make sure make sure na pipirma po yung yung ka-partner po ninyo yung asawa po ninyo so if you are look at, if you are OFW you must have a representative dito sa Pilipinas ang tawag po doon is attorney in fact or in layman terms, ang, ini, ang lagi po sinasabi nila is SP. SP is a form. AIF, that is the representative. So, you get the the, the loan through bank or, or pag-ibig or in-house. So, what are the differences of those three? Uh, for bank financing, um, for you to qualify, kailangan wala po kayong canceled credit card, wala po kayong existing how, uh, car or housing loan, or kung meron man, dapat mataas pa po yung natitirang salary in order for you to avail for another for another property investment. Very critical na wala po tayong cancel credit card. If you are availing that through pag eBay financing, dapat hindi po tayo naging co-borrower na isang housing loan o wala po tayong naging housing loan dati na pinabayaan. So kapag hindi po tayo pasado, hindi tayo pwede sa pag eBay and 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 bank financing, the good thing is you can get a in-house financing uh, through developer. But the, the one thing that you have to consider, if you are getting that through in-house financing, kadalasan po, the interest rate is three times higher compared when you get the loan through bank or what even financing. So let me help you more about your investment. Call us call me at 917 849 1340. I hope you learned something new today.